it baffles me so much the rate at which men lose their mind when it comes to women most especially when it comes to their wife concerning the story of this couple who shot his wife and put a call through to the police to tell the police what he has done and that is a top military mindset because normal people want to run and what do you really think could really cause this according to the story the man is a military man in nigeria he sent the wife abroad and blah 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 at the end of the day he still sent further funds to upgrade the woman into having a dressing saloon and everything after four years or thereabout he set up himself and meet up with the wife but by the time he gets there the wife is big already being a fresh comer in the u.s he's still struggling doing some petty business to really make some money but it's nowhere compared to that of his wife the wife starts frustrating him disrespecting him and all manner of things to the extent that she had to buy a new house move the children and herself without the man there after a little while he still had to tell the man if you want to see your children you have to seek permission and then he had to tell the wife to move away from the previous house that he need to rent it out to make more money think about this it is devastating and that is what made the man to conclude go ahead on a bad day to shoot her and call the police these are common stories between man and woman all over the places you see men sponsoring their wife to school and everything. At the end of the day, the woman comes out and say, you are not my type. Sometimes they might get married and at the end of the day, the wife will claim to have overgrown the husband. And that is always the problem when you do this to women. My dear brother, no this and no peace. Women are born brutal. But men will become brutal due to frustration loss rejection and everything the exception is very very little you believe your wife is nice and kind and you believe that is how she is to everybody for you to verify go and look for those men she rejected before dating you or married to you and ask for their experiences then you will know what your wife is capable of doing only very few women can really be so nice and kind like you are really thinking about the okonjo well uh Akweli, they are different set of angel they are not common among women i hate to see men going down because life imprisonment is no joke and killing someone is also not reasonable in all ramifications meanwhile before this man get to this position i want you men to understand he has shot himself severally before he gets to shoot the woman. And number one, he failed to envisage the capacity of what the woman can become if he is out of reach, if he's out of check. Number two, living separately for over three months as couple is too dangerous. It breaks the marriage faster than anything you can imagine. No physical touch, no physical intimacy forget about the number of video you are sending to one another it is all a mind game number three you dare not upgrade a woman more than yourself because the moment a woman becomes bigger or more valuable than you my dear brother he ca she can rubbish you at any point in time number four regardless your commitment your effort your whatever you do women are loyal to their feeling and their feelings are not stable the moment they find a new ground of higher status, you are gone. Number five, regardless of who you are, women don't care what you are capable of or who you are. If you like, be governor or whatever, they can dump you at any point in time for whatever reason. Number six, the moment a woman takes leadership role with the ability to be able to finance it, then you are no longer in control. And that is truth. And lastly, number seven, hypergamy syndrome is natural to women. Only few women can really get out of it the moment they find their husband. And that is why so many women today have no husband, despite their status, their beauty, and what have you. They become single forever. My dear brother, viable men are going down. 
and we need to know that men we are an endangered species yes it is of a truth that uh, boys and girls are born at equal proportion but you think about it the rate at which men are in prison for different criminalities and everything over 97 percent of the prisoners in the world are men so many men are dying in war so many men become useless due to drugs so many men are dying from dangerous jobs and several other conditions my dear brother you need to really wise up and be smart in your decision making when it comes to women because the moment they shake the front side and the back side for you you lose your sense completely my dear brother you need to watch